respect is very important when it comes to relationships. Mutual respect in a relationship is very vital. It is actually the backbone of every relationship and more so a romantic relationship. A relationship that does not have respect will struggle to survive and eventually it will collapse. Respect for men is different from the respect women want. And for the case of women, respect can be adopted with time because it is simple compared to that for men. A relationship where there is no respect is good as death. Join me today in this video as I tell you, as I give you what you can do or how you can earn respect even without trying to do anything in your relationship. My name is Robert and join me in this video. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing if you're watching this video and share with friends. Click on the notification bell so that anytime we upload a video, you are able to see it and like it. So, relationships often fail because a woman does not respect the man. This comes about when there are six things that haven't been done in this relationship. And I'm going to give you those six things that you have to do in order to earn respect from your partner. Number one, control your emotions. So basically, a woman would want a man who is a thoughtful man. Someone who thinks fast and acts accordingly. So, if you're this kind of a man, maybe you have gone out in a restaurant for food, for a drink, and all of a sudden, a waiter maybe steps you or does something messy and you just blast out. In the presence of your woman, you're creating what we call fear. So, if in your relationship you've created fear in your partner, she will not be actually respecting you, but she will be fearing you. And by the time fear is no more in her, even respect will go through the window. She will not respect you. And hey, do not be this kind of guy who is, again, so emotional on everything. Maybe you're watching a movie which is full of sorrow and all you're doing is crying. A movie is full of laughter and you're laughing, you're laughing endlessly and you're also bringing out tears. Basically, women do not love soft guys. You don't need to be a softie in life because a woman will actually not respect you. So, control your emotions. If you're a short-tempered man, do not cause terror in your home, but let respect be earned, because it is not a command. Respect is earned. Number two, increase your value. Every woman wants to be around a man who is ambitious in life, who is pursuing his career. Maybe he has gotten a promotion at work. Maybe he is trying to start up new businesses. He is working hard to achieve his goals. A woman would want to be around a guy who is attaining it or who is making it in life, not a failure. And by that, a woman is respecting you. That's why, if I give you an example, when we were in school, you would see ladies would always want to be around that kind of guy who is a genius in class. 
it's not because maybe they are attracted to him, but they respect him because of being well upstairs. Number three, respect her. Generally, if anyone wants to be respected, you have to respect others. Because respect is and it's not a command. Much as a woman wants to be with you, but you have also to give her her personal time. She is your wife. But it doesn't mean you have to control whatever is going on in her life. She also has a private life. Yeah? So, all you need is to give her the respect that she deserves as a woman. When you're in public, try to give her the respect. Treat her the way a woman would be treated. Or even if you're at home, give her the respect as woman and as your wife. Number four. Number four. Do not be clingy. So basically, most of the men, majority, I can say, would want their ladies to be in places where they are. Yes, in the first place, it can be seen as a romantic thing because you people are moving together, are doing most of the things together. But as time goes on, hey, this woman needs herself. She needs to do something when you're not around. Let her go out with friends. Give her even transport. Give her money to go out with friends and enjoy. Someone saying, I love you, does not mean they have given you the permission to consume everything that goes on in their lives. Remember, before you met this person, she had her personal life. She had her ambitions. She had her dreams. She had her goals to achieve. And you came in because you are one of her goals. You're one of her dreams. So do not go ahead to control whatever is going on in her life. She has friends. She has family. Give her her space. It doesn't mean when they say give her her space, you ignore her. No. I mean, if it is private time, give her her time to enjoy with friends, family, and anyone. Maybe it's her career. Let her actually go higher. Do not try to actually push her down because you are in her life. No. Number five. Number five. Be independent. So, in this generation, we have many men who are mommy's boys. So, a mommy's boy, your mom will always be intervening in your relationship. Everyone has a mom. And even if someone doesn't have a mom, they have that person who has taken care of them. is a parent. So, if you have chosen to be in a relationship, let your mother not intervene, maybe because you're the only son, maybe you're the beloved boy at home, but the fact that you have gotten a wife or you have a girlfriend, you are trying to be independent. Let your, let your wife care for you the way she knows. So, this is where the problem comes in. Your mother comes at home and is telling your wife, Hey, cook for my son like this. My son does not eat this. Wash for my son this. Why didn't you lay the bed for my son? Hell! Let your woman take care of everything. Because she also came to you so that you people can make a family. Not your mother coming from her home to come and take control of you. There, your woman will actually know that you are not independent in mind and you cannot make any decision at home. She will not respect you, but she will see you as her burden and possibly she is going to walk away. She will not respect you because she knows you cannot decide for yourself. Everyone loves being advised, 
But decision making is always for one person. It is for one mind. They can advise you, but they cannot decide for you. You need to decide for yourself. And by that, you will be able to achieve it all. Number six, keep your word. A woman loves someone who is a man of his word. If you promise her something, maybe she has said, Oh, babe, I would like you to assist me with some money. I want to pay for something. I want to pay my mortgage. And you say, I'm going to give you the money tomorrow. And tomorrow you don't show up. You don't even text. You don't even call. The next day you say, I'm coming. And you don't come. She will be seeing you as a liar, irresponsible, not someone of his word. By that, you are losing respect. Remember, respect is not a command. Respect is earned by what you do. So, if you're a man who doesn't keep his word, who does, the, who does not act according to your words, the lady will not respect you. And let me tell you the truth. Ladies do not like liars. You got to be straight and respect the word you tell her and fulfill it. By that, she will actually respect you and count on you in anything. If it is serious, she will always know someone is there for me when I need him. Thank you so much for watching and if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and click on the notification bell so that anytime we upload a video, you can be able to watch it, you can share with friends and let's go higher. Thanks.